Today, people nationwide celebrated Juneteenth in observation of the end of slavery in the U.S. And in Sioux Falls this past weekend, a celebration was held at 8th and Railroad to commemorate the day. But tonight, some people gathered for a short ceremony near the Ark of Dreams. Kevin Lance Carter Schmidt was there and joins us now to recap the celebrations. Carter? Good evening, Don and Bridget. At 8 o'clock this evening, people came out to the landmark downtown to celebrate the holiday. I caught up with some Juneteenth Sioux Falls organizers to find out how celebrations went this year and why they say it's important. Freedom. After a full day of celebration Saturday, some people still gathered tonight, including president of the local NAACP chapter, Langston Newton. We're going to light up the Ark of Dreams in uh, red, green, and yellow as a way to celebrate uh, Juneteenth. South Dakota African American History Museum researcher Zach Van Harris Jr. was also a speaker at the event. So the Ark of Dreams, you know, is a representation of that connection, and we got the the Juneteenth colors represented and that's helping bring the harmony in the community and just bringing it all together, tying it all together. Juneteenth observes the end of slavery in the United States. This day in June 19th in 1865, we, we tend to celebrate uh, freedom for all Americans as, as on this day, uh, General Granger actually rode up to Galveston, Texas and, and announced the, uh, and <laughs> demanded that the last uh, slaves out of Texas were freed. Juneteenth, it's not a black celebration. It is an American celebration. And that's what I want everyone to get the message is like, it's not just for black people, this is for America. It's, it's the importance is this is big for America, for all of us to recognize that it's Freedom Day. People who attended the celebration Saturday say it was a great turnout. It was good food, good music. I mean, it was great community. It was an awesome celebration of uh, just freedom. And to see our coverage of Juneteenth from Saturday, it is attached to this story on Kelloland.com. Thank you, Carter.